Hi, I'm Mark Ryan. And today I want to talk about something that was announced at the Google Cloud Next conference in April of 2024. And that is grounding with Google Search in Vertex AI. I think this is a really exciting new capability of Vertex AI, and I want to try it out. So we're going to take a look at the Vertex AI UI, try it out there, and show what it gives us. Before we look at grounding with Google Search in the context of Vertex AI, let's take a quick look at the documentation. So it goes through, describes what's required, and there are a number of different approaches we can take. We can, we can use a curl command in their description here to do that. We can create a little Python program to do it, but for simplicity's sake and to get that quick hit of adrenaline, we are going to go into the console and try it there. So here we are in Vertex AI in the Google Cloud console. And to try out grounding with Google Search, we go and click on multimodal. And then open up prompt design. And what we're going to do is just take a vanilla Gemini 1.5. I'm going to ask a question, pretty simple question. Who is the prime minister? of New Zealand. See what answer we get. And the answer is Chris Hipkins. Is that really the answer? Now, I am more of a fan of Australian politics, so I don't follow New Zealand politics quite as closely. But let's see if we can get a better answer or a different answer using grounding with Google search. In order to take advantage of grounding with Google search, we go over here, we click on advanced and we scroll down to enable grounding. Now, if you haven't done this before, if you haven't done this before, you're gonna be asked to acknowledge the terms. I've already done that. So I can go ahead and click on customize. And here I have the choice of grounding with Vertex AI search, which is I've done a video on before, so I can create a data store in Vertex AI search and ground with that but I'm going to ground with Google search. So select it just like that. So now I'm going to ask the same question. So before the answer was Chris Hipkins. Now let's ask the question again, now grounded with Google search. And we see the answer is Christopher Luxon. And he did indeed become the prime minister of New Zealand in November of 2023. And there is a source for it here. So citation. We've seen how easy it is to take advantage of grounding with Google search in the Vertex AI UI. And we see that it actually produces answers for questions that are time sensitive, such as this question, and produces the correct answer. So try it out and hope you have fun with it. Thanks very much.